my name is Davi Lima Verde, and um, I come originally from Brazil, and I live in Amsterdam. Mm -hmm. I work with um, um, participatory theater methodologies, and as a freelance, and also with an organization called PLEC, that it's based in the Netherlands. Well, I've always wanted to connect uh, social work and art. And uh, since the times that I was working with the street children in Brazil, I wanted to find creative methodologies to be more effective with them, with the children. And then it was when I thought, okay, I have to study. I have to study a specific artistic discipline. So I was co more connected with theater. So that's why I went to the theater school. And then later, I started finding connections between theater and social transformation and working with conflicts with real people living on the streets. I have, we have a theater group in Amsterdam, so uh, young people, they are welcome to be part of the theater group. But also, uh, we have, uh, we show our place to young people, and so they are our audience. And we use theater to talk about a specific uh, uh, topic, an oppression, a conflict, yeah? So um, we use theater to reach the, the youth, but we also use theater by the youth. Well, not only for this method, but also for any method, is whenever you go to work with a group of people, you come with the method, you know, with a system. And sometimes it doesn't really work uh, in that specific situation. And I think we have, as facilitators, educators, or artists, we have to be sensitive in order to uh, adapt, change, or we, we, we have to adapt, change, or completely go to another uh, plan. Mm -hmm. And then um, be sensitive to the group that we are working with. So um, the bright side of a methodology is that you have a tool. Okay. The low uh, highlight of the methodology is that it can give you a, a, a prison in order to work with a. You have to be sensitive. Yeah. Yeah, I went to the, the, the situation that I explained to the group before. Um, I, I wanted to do a, a theater project with the children in the Amazon. And meeting with them, it just didn't, it didn't work. My plan, my methodology, to work with their conflicts wasn't really working. So I had to go with another plan and be sensitive to what they were offering. And so I chose to work with the cartography, which was a completely different methodology, but I was uh, trying to uh, develop. And now I'm still developing the methodology. Yeah. And yeah, this is a... a an example of yeah, this change of plans. In any country, there's something happening with the theater of the oppressed. And I must say that it's quite effective, you know. Um, of course, you have to be sensitive to the group, and maybe you're going to change things. But I think this is a method that puts people in a place that they can speak up, you know. Uh, the audience is not passive. The audience can uh, change things in the play, can say whatever they want, 
can bring um, uh, suggestions or uh, solutions for the conflict. Yeah, not every methodology gives the power to the to the audience, to the people, and this is one. I think it's a good point.